And we begin tonight with developing news out of Sacramento. One person is found dead and two others are sent to the hospital after an early morning house fire. The ensuing investigation also leading to an arrest tonight. And thanks so much for joining us for Fox 40 News at 10. I'm Eric Rucker. Fox 40's Joanna Shaddix joins us live outside of that house. And Ro, you spoke with one of the people that live in that house today, correct? That is correct, Eric. We caught him just as he was coming home from the hospital. Now, he did know that one of the roommates, the landlady who he's known since 10th grade, was still in the hospital. He knew, knew that another roommate had died inside the house, but what he didn't know is that third suspect was arrested for that death. This early morning house fire on Roseburg Court killed a 55 year old male resident inside. Two other roommates went to the hospital. Yeah, he just picked me up at the hospital. Yoron Knighton was just coming back home and tells Fox 40 the fire was frightening. Well, I was trying to get out when I saw the smoke come up in my room because you know, it was like it was, it was, it was a nightmare. And like it was so black. We just talked to the sheriff's department yeah. and you know your roommate was arrested. He was? Deputies arrested 61 year old Tyrone Gregory on suspicion of voluntary manslaughter. Investigators believe Gregory didn't start the fire, but was responsible for the victim's death. Sure. I'm sorry, but the one who passed away, where was he? I don't know, but this room was that first room right there. The first one, right when you yeah, walk in. Yeah, when you walk in into the right, it's the smallest one. He was renting in that room there. And he was in there. Yeah, that's what uh, the police told me. In his room on the floor, I didn't know that until the police told me we're all good friends, including with Gregory, the suspect. He was a good guy. He was like the uh, the technician, the maintenance guy here for the owner, and he did all you know. He cooked and everything. He's a good guy. Wow, so it must surprise you that. that yeah, you said he got arrested. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, unless there's something happened that I don't don't know. The victim was involved in an altercation with one of them, and uh, which ultimately we think led to his uh, demise. Obviously, he had some culpability based on our detective's uh, investigation. Surprising when they said that he had passed away. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, me too. My heart goes out to him and his family and stuff, and this 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 is it's tragic. The SAC Metro reminds us that it is a really good time to check on the batteries in your smoke detectors just to make sure that they are in working order. The gentleman that you heard from there said that they do have smoke detectors inside this house, but they were not working. Reporting live in Sacramento County tonight, Rowena Shaddix, Fox 40 News. Ro, thank you for the